Hello and welcome to my channel Study with Pradipto. Today I will discuss how you will take preparation for the NPTEL final exam of the course Data Structures and Algorithm using Job. The exam date is given that is 26 October 2024 and the time of the exam is morning session starting from 9 am to 12 pm and the afternoon session starting from 2 pm to 5 pm. It will be mentioned in your hall tickets. So in this video, I will discuss the certificate criteria, the exam pattern, and what type of questions might be there in the final exam. Okay. Now first coming to the certificate criteria. Final score will be made of 25% of average assignment score and 75% of the certificate exam score. That means the final exam you will give, suppose you get 60 marks out of 100 then 75 percent of 60 that is 45 will be added to your final score okay and 40 is needed out of 100 to pass the exam and the final exam will be of 100 marks paper and you have to score 40 and in the assignment also you have to score 40 now uh, please note that based of three six or eight assignments are taken for the courses of four eight and twelve weeks so this is a 12 week course so your best eight assignments will be taken for the uh, certificate criteria. Okay. Now, how you will know uh, wh what marks you get in the assignments? After coming to the NPTEL website, you will find one tab that is progress tab. Okay. So, click this tab. Then this type of screen will come in front of you. Then here, you will see assignment scores. Okay. So, click it. Then you will get the assignment score. Okay. Now, take your best 8 assignment score and sum all the assignment score. Then take 25% of that score. Okay. Suppose your average assignment score is 90. Okay. Now, 25% of 90 you have to take. Okay. That means 22.5 you will get and it will be added to your final score. Now, next, I will discuss the exam pattern. Okay. 50 questions will be there in the exam. Uh, questions will be divided into three sections. Section A, Section B and Section C. Each question will be of two marks. Now the total marks is 100. Okay. Now, section A will consist 10 questions which is which will consist 20 marks. Section B will consist 15 questions, 30 marks and Section C will consist 25 questions, 50 marks. There will be no negative marking. So I will give you suggestion that please don't leave any questions unattempted. Okay. Please at least attempt every question. If you don't know the answers also, please attempt because no negative marking is there. Now, I will come that how you will take preparation. Okay. Now, suppose in the week one assignments, you see these questions that which of the following statements is true about linear and non-linear data structure in Java. You made the answers correct. Okay. Array and linked list are linear data structures while graph and tree are non-linear data structures. They uh, often change the options okay now if you know that uh, which are the data structures that are linear and which are the data structures that are non-linear then you will surely make the answers if the uh, options uh, are changed okay i am talking about this chart okay suppose if you know that uh, which data structures are linear which data structures are non-linear then if the options are changed then you can also make the answers correctly like they might give in the array uh, in the place of arrays and linked list they might give stacks and pv so you you will not face any difficulties in answering the questions if you know this chart. Okay, like in this way, you have to think what questions might be asked. Okay. Now, another th type of questions will be, they will give one score snippets and they will give options. And between these options, one options might be the correct options. Okay. So this type of questions is also asked in the final exam. So what you may do, you may find the questions in the assignments they asked in the previous session, like in the 2023 session or in the 2024 January session, in all the assignments, what type of question they asked? Because most of the questions they will give from the assignment. Okay. If you do the assignment questions properly in these sessions and in the previous sessions, the questions, then you will surely able to pass the exam. Okay. So if you get some help from this video, then please subscribe my channel. Okay. And best of luck for your exam. Thank you.